Welcome back to your mats, everybody. This is your 10 minute practice. And we're gonna add some elements here that we didn't in the last practices. We've mostly stuck to sudden salutes. We'll add a couple of warriors and have a little bit of fun with it. In the last practice, you saw that Alexa wanted to keep going. So sometimes if you wanna keep going, uh, feel free to pause the video or to turn, me off, turn it off or to tune me out and to keep going. Uh, what I like to have around me is my props. You can use them or not use them. I usually like to start out with the props and then perhaps move away from them if you don't uh, want to use them, if you want to challenge yourself, if you want to add them. Do what you want to do with your props. It's your practice. Do what feels good for you. So we're going to do a 10 minute practice. Coming to the top of your mat, lift and spreading your toes and let's see if Alexa will cooperate today. Alexa, will you set a timer for 10 minutes? 10 minutes, starting now. So coming to the top of your mat, lift and spread your toes. Make sure you have your blocks at the top of your mat on your highest setting. Lift and spread your toes, root down through your feet, squeeze your belly, curl your shoulder blades onto your back, inhale, reach the arms high to the sky, right hand reaches over to left wrist as you crescent over, inhale back through center, second side. Inhale, reach up, sweep the arms behind you, lace the fingertips together this time, and just lengthen the arms down as you lift the chest open. Now bend the knees, and you can either keep your thumbs at your sacrum as you fold forward, hugging your elbows toward the center of your body, or if it's available to you, you can allow the arms to fall away from you, taking a deep breath in. Now bending into the knees, reach the arms forward. Let's come into our chair pose. Take a good deep breath in, take the right arm back behind you, look over the right shoulder, come back through center, and left arm. And really watch your knees, they're gonna want to shift forward. See if you can keep them in line with each other. Back through center, fold, fingertips or hands come to the block. And now let's step back with our right foot into a lunge taking our blocks to a lower setting and stepping back into downward facing dog. So I use the blocks here to lengthen my arms, looking back through my legs, pushing down through my heels, take a few deep breaths in here. Inhale forward to top of a push up, exhale push back to downward facing dog, and you can either walk or hop to the top of your mat. If you wanna hop, take your feet out wide or bend your knees and hop your feet wide of your hands or your blocks. Good, and fold, inhale, sweep the arms high to the sky, right hand grabs a hold of left wrist and crescent over, back through center, second side. Inhale, reach up, exhale, fold, fingertips come to the blocks. Inhale, half lift, exhale, fold, and now bring your feet closer together, step your left foot back to a lunge, Right foot back to downward facing dog. Inhale forward to top of a push up. Exhale, push back to down dog. Bend the knees, look forward toward the hands, neither walk or hop toward the top of your mat. And fold. Inhale, sweep the arms high to the sky. Right hand grabs a hold of left wrist, crescent over. Inhale back through center, second side. Inhale, reach up, look up, exhale, fold, reach back. Inhale, circle your arms up and around, and now sit back into chair pose, hands at prayer. Now you can do an open twist by sitting back, trying to keep the knees in line, right, left hand forward, right hand back. If you wanna do more of a closed twist, you can hook the left elbow behind the right knee. So open twist, closed twist. You do what works best for your body. Take a nice deep breath in here, Inhale, come back through center. And again, you can either take your open twist or you can take your closed twist. Pick your twist, it doesn't matter. Hooking the right elbow behind the left knee. Beautiful. Inhale, back through center. Exhale, fold. Right leg back to a lunge. Left leg back to down dog. Inhale, forward to top of a push up. Exhale, this time let's lower down knees, chest, chin. Inhale, curl your shoulders back. Push the tops of your feet down. Exhale, lift the hips up and back. Press back to down dog. So let's play a little bit here. Left leg lifts high, and now step your left foot behind your left block. And then pivot and plant your right foot and circle up into warrior two pose. Bend into the square of the knee, line up your torso over your hips, 
and take a moment to breathe here. Good. Now taking the left hand windmilling it back down to the floor, pivot on the back toe, push off with the left foot, downward facing dog. Inhale forward to plank. Exhale back to down dog. And now right foot high to the sky and step your right foot wide of your right block. Good. Pivot and plant your left foot, circle up. Warrior two, lining the torso up over the hips. Heel the ankle alignment. Take a breath here. Now we'll windmill our hands back down to the blocks. Pivot on our left toes, push off with the right foot and come back to down dog. Inhale forward to plank, lower down knees, chest, chin, lower. Inhale, curl through cobra. You can also come to up dog here if it speaks to you. Press back to downward facing dog. And now walk your feet forward towards your hands. You can also hop here. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, sweep all the way up to the sky. Right hand grabs a hold of left wrist, crescent over. Back through center, left side. Inhale, reach up, look up. Exhale, reach back behind you. Inhale, circle your arms up and around. Look up, sit back into chair pose. Take your version of chair, open twist or close twist. Whatever works for you. And twist to the opposite side. Back through center, fold. Good, inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold, right leg back to a lunge. Left leg back to down dog. Inhale forward to a plank. Exhale lower down. Inhale roll through. Exhale down dog. Left leg high to the sky. And now step your left foot wide. Do you notice I come up onto my fingertips? That's because I'm not using my block here. Circle up warrior two. And take a moment to catch yourself. Breathe. Now we're going to add on here. Right hand down the back of the right thigh, left arm up to the sky. And now left forearm to the top of the thigh, right arm up and over the ear. Right hand down to the block or to the floor, spin up onto the right toes, left arm up to the sky. Now hands frame that front leg. If it doesn't quite work, use your blocks here. And then you're going to rock back, rock forward, rock back rock forward, rock back, push off, and step forward, okay? Inhale, reach for the sky. Exhale, hands through heart center, breathe. Inhale, reach. Exhale, fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. And now your left foot steps back into a lunge pose. Breathe here. And now step back to down dog. Inhale forward to top of a push-up, exhale lower. Inhale, roll through cobra, push the tops of the feet down. Exhale, push back through downward facing dog. And now go ahead and take that right foot and step it behind that right block. Pivot and plant, come up warrior two. I'll give you a moment to catch yourself here. I know the practice is going quickly, but you do what you can do here. Push out and wide through the feet, peaceful warrior. Extend at side angle, so right forearm to the thigh, left arm to the sky, and then left hand down to the block, spin up onto the left toes, right arm up to the sky. Both hands come to the block, and this is where I'm gonna do the rocking. I'm gonna rock back, lift the heels, rock forward. Rock back, rock forward, rock back, push off, feet step together. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, sweep the arms high to the sky. Right hand grabs a hold of left wrist. Crescent over. Back through center, second side. Inhale, reach up, look up. Exhale, fold. Fingertips come to the floor. Blocks the earth, your shins, wherever you like. Inhale, lift. Exhale, fold. Plant the hands onto your blocks. Step back into downward facing dog. Inhale, forward to plank pose. Exhale, knees, chest, chin, lower down. Inhale, roll through cobra. And this time, exhale, come back to a seated pose now. So placing the blocks out of the way, make your way to seated. Crossing the ankles, sitting up onto a bolster block or blanket. 
And now taking your left hand to your right knee and taking a twist here, looking over the right shoulder. Inhale back through center, second side. Good. Making your way onto your back now, planting the hands, tucking the tailbone under, curling your back down, drawing your knees into your chest, gently rocking side to side. Beautiful. Taking your hands behind your head, looking towards your knees, extend your left leg parallel to the floor, cross the left elbow to the right knee, bring it in, and then cross the right elbow to the left knee as you lengthen through the leg. So let's bicycle up for seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Plant both feet down onto the earth. Bring your hands down by your side. Tuck your shoulder blades underneath you. Walk your heels closer to your bottom. Inhale, lift your hips up. Alexa, stop. Exhale, lower down. Two more. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. Last one. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. And then come to a rest. If you'd like to stay here for a few minutes, catch your breath and take a Shavasana by all means. If you need to get on with your day, roll over to your right side, make your way up to seated. But thank you for joining me. So you can get a lot done in 10 minutes in terms of working up some heat, working out a little sweat on, working a little bit of sweat, coming to your mat. So remember, your practice doesn't have to be half an hour, 45 minutes an hour. It can be as little as three, five, seven, or 10 minutes. Thank you for joining me for this series. If you liked any of the props that I have in the series, feel free to check out the links below where you can get a discount on a life form mat, uh, props from Gaim, and clothing options from Gaim. Thank you so much for joining me. Have a fantastic day. Namaste.